Hi beauties and curls, welcome back. Today's video, we're gonna get straight into it. It's a natural hair haul. Yes, I said that. Now I do have makeup, but I'm more excited about this natural hair haul because I'm just excited. So I did get a chance to go and pick up some new stuff that I wanna try here on the channel, as well as re-up on some favorites. Yeah, some holy grails. So let's just jump right into this video because I am running a bit behind, but I just wanted to get this video out to you guys. Let me know what you're hauling. Haul out of, haul out of natural hair. Yeah, let me know what you guys are hauling. Haul out of natural hair and something is on my eye and I can't get it all. Okay, so let me know what you guys are hauling and let's get straight into this. I did get some PR, so I wanted to share that with you guys first because I wanna get you guys' opinions on what you want to see first. Now, I do have a first impressions coming on a new product from Diva Curl. So the first thing I received from Diva Curl is this micro fiber towel. I cannot wait to use this because I use t-shirts. So I wanna do t-shirt versus the microfiber towel, yes. So I'm really excited about getting this and it says filming. I feel like I'm violating the towel right now. I got from them. They know that I love the decadence, Lord. So y'all know it felt like Christmas getting these two. This is the Diva Curl No Poo Decadence and the One Conditioning. This is my all time favorite. I love you. I'm in love with the No Poo. I love these two. I did um, unbox these on Snapchat on the Ipsy when I did um, the Ipsy take over the Snapchat but I wanted to show you guys these um, I love these I do have a review on these and I will list it I do have a review on these too if you want to check it out and some other diva curl products but I do have some that they recommended that I try specialized for my hair so I wanted to try to tie them out but I do have a this says that it is 100% sulfate free silicone free and paraben free I'm really happy about that and this is for texture and volume and it's a style and shape product now y'all know I have fine thin hair so this I'm praying will be a miracle product yes the next thing I got was the light defining gel now I think I tried the ultra before this is the light defining I'm just trying to find my perfect I love deeper curl so I wanted to try some especially since they're at sold at Sephora I do want to try Sephora products yes so for you guys to see if it's worth it you know what I'm saying but this is the light defining gel style hold no crunch styler I love no crunch so yeah hopefully this will work the next thing I have from them is the Diva Curl Believe In. Now this says that it is 100% sulfate free, silicone free, and paraben free. I'm really happy about that. And this is for texture and volume, and it's a style and shape product. Now y'all know I have fine thin hair, so this I'm praying will be a miracle product. Yes. Um, yeah, can't wait to try this. The next thing I got was the light defining gel. Now, I think I tried the ultra before. This is the light defining. I'm just trying to find my perfect. I love deeper curl, so I wanted to try some, especially since they're at, sold at Sephora. I do want to try Sephora products. Yes. So for you guys to see if it's worth it, you know what I'm saying? But this is the light defining gel style hold no crunch styler. I love no crunch. So yeah, hopefully this will work. I have been kind of scared about mousses y'all. I don't know. I'm like, I don't know. Like I think a creamy style of gel styler, but I've never tried mousses. So mama's going to try mousses. Missy Pelo, you trying mousses, honey. <laughs> this is the frizz free volumizing foam. This is lightweight body booster for texture and volume. I would say now my mom has fine thin hair as well as well as my mother in love and my mother in love loves mousses like loves she like promises down like Moroccan oil hair mousse she gave me that and I was like I don't know what to do with that so I'm, I'm really excited and it says frizz free do y'all see the frizz already happening on my hair yes we need to try you okay I think that might be good for like flexi rods or a roller set or something but I do want to try that 
on a wash and go and see how it works. Okay, and finally, I think this is the last thing that I do have from Diva Curl. This is the Build Up Booster Eye. This is like a micellar water cleansing serum for your hair. I love micellar waters for my skin. So this one I'm hoping would be great for my hair. I'm so excited. I can't wait to try it. Yes, and I did try it, y'all. But a first impressions is coming because y'all know I do the first impressions for makeup and hair. I'm going to include this one and I'm going to try it again. But I have used a lot of this. Not a lot, but I have used. I feel like it's a lot because this was full. I'm so excited about those. Thank you so much, Diva Curl, for sending those to me. I cannot wait to try it. Okay, so the next things are OGs. And y'all know I love this. Okay, so the first two... Um, the Cura Beauty, congratulations. They are moving into a new spot. Y'all, they are growing like cray cray. This is the Bacura Beauty Nectarine Vanilla Honey Latte Detangling Hair Milk. I love this because they're glycerin free. It has castor seed oil. These, a lot of my products I noticed have a lot of castor seed oil in it, which is great for hair growth. So I love this and my hair grew like crazy using these products. So if you are into, like this is just a great product just in general but this product and the product that I'm about to show you also has castor seed this is the Bacura apple and sorghum hair syrup supple hair syrup and I love this y'all I already have one in my I have one that I've finished I have one in my like my bathroom and I have two backups that's how much I love this like I did like a top 10 for summer this is like a year round for my lock method this is amazing and the first ingredient is castor seed oil and if you ever read ingredients ingredients those things mean that it's the most potent in the product castor seed oil is number one so I am so excited this one is pumped with a whole bunch of great oils and I love this on to the next now I picked this up because my hair stylist uh, Kiana has her own line and I wanted to review her products. This is the Curl Smoothie Curly Fi by Kiana. This is her leave-in conditioner and this is a curl and volume texture. This is a gel mousse. It looks like a gel and then it turns into a mousse. So I am so so excited and her and I have like our hair textures are light. Mine is a little bit coarser, but she was like, to have, definitely you can like try this and let me know what you think. So I'm really excited about these. I did pick these up from her. I got some stuff from Ulta. I did, y'all see it's still in the bag. I wanted to finish reviewing this line. So I picked up the Monongo and Hemp Seed High Porosity Moisture Shampoo. So I'm really excited about this because y'all know I love the deep conditioner. And this is the gel. I cannot wait to try these. <laughs> I know they have a co-wash but I'm not really into co-washing anymore and I will come with a video about that but a dollar off yes for some more shade moisture and y'all know I probably use that on another deep conditioner because that hair mask is everything that's like my number one this is from my local beauty supply store and I had never seen these products I saw maybe one but I want to show you. So I picked up a hair scarf. This I wanted to use. Um, it has like the little ball on the end. But it's like a hair scarf. And I picked it up and it was like $5. Um, for my hair tutorials. Like when my hair is not done. But you still want to look put together. You know. So I got some Cream of Nature products. But these I had never seen before. Not even the co-wash. Let me know if you guys have seen this. This is the Pure Licious Co-wash Cleansing Conditioner. Now if it's a cleansing conditioner I will use it. Because they say it's a co-wash, but I will not use a, an actual conditioner to cleanse my hair. If it says cleansing conditioner, I will use it because this is a creamy. Um, it says made with butter blend of argon for exotic shine. And this says no frizz, no shrinkage, no dryness. So that's a big plan, y'all. Yes. So the next thing I got was the, let's see, I got the hair mask. This is the Silkening Hair Mask. Curl Repair Deep Treatment. I got two styling products because this one seemed like it's better for my hair, but at the same time, I think I would, I don't know, this one like really caught my name. So this one is the uh, Butterlicious Curls for Hydrating Cream. It's weightless hydration for soft curls. So I'm thinking this one would probably be great for my high porosity fine thin hair. And I probably could use this in like just do a wash and go and this be like my one product to put in my hair but this is a twirling custard it's a curl styling gel so it's a gel but it's a cream so that's what really 
uh, call my name and it says no frizz no shrinkage no dryness and it also says defines and elongates for crunch free curls so I have two stylers a cleansing conditioner and a hair mask and y'all know I'm gonna be trying this hair mask to me really like let's get it's kind of like my barometer if I want to go further into I don't know it's like dating you know if that first date is not good you kind of like don't want to go on the second or a third you know <laughs> so uh, yes this is like the product that's the first date and if you are good maybe I will think about the other ones but I definitely want to try the deep conditioner I had to get this now this is the one that I've seen before but this is the cream of nature strength and shine leave-in conditioner I wanted to try this because this has oils in it and I thought it would be good for my lock method and um, this would also be good if I wanted to blow dry my hair because I don't want to use a thick um, leave-in conditioner this is something and it this one kind of kind of reminds me of the allocate naturals one and I want to try a more affordable one so one of my viewers that has uh, watched one of my view videos was telling me that it was like $17 for the leave-in conditioner for the allocate naturals and I'm like yeah that is a lot for a leave-in spray and conditioner so this one was only six dollars so i'm really excited about trying this so those are my products you guys i hope you guys enjoyed this video don't forget to give it a thumbs up let me know what you want me to try first okay and come with a review so i love you guys and i will see beautiful you in the next video